All right, so just another question here related to the second derivative test. So suppose we've got a, a critical point at x equals 4 and the derivative equals 0. Um, we want to know if the, the, if the second derivative is 2x minus 6, what can we say about the function, hap, you know, what occurs at x equals 4? So again, the idea is if we've got a critical point and the derivative is 0, well, if the second derivative is positive, if it's positive, that means that would make it concave up, and then we would have a minimum. If the second derivative is negative, that's going to make it concave down, and we have a maximum. So all we have to do is just plug in this point, uh, x equals 4, into our second derivative. Well, in this case, we'll get 2 times 4 minus 6. Hey, that's just 8 minus 6, or positive 2, um, which is certainly greater than 0. And what that would tell us is that f is concave up since the second derivative is positive. And again, since it's concave up and we've got this critical point, that's going to tell us at x equals 4 there would be a local minimum.